the day has finally come. It's the launch of Hobart Park Run. We're here at Risdon Dam, northern suburbs of Hobart, and people are getting excited. We're only 10 minutes away from the start. It's pretty chilly here today, but I uh, can't wait to get stuck into the first ever Hobart Park Run. Hobart Park Run, very historic occasion. Looks, looks to be a healthy number of runners here. With the event directors. What do you reckon, Anna? How many people we got out here? Uh, I'm predicting about um, 100. 100. 100. Great. All right. How many, Lynn? Right, Mel. Good job. What about you, Craig Byrne? Yeah, uh, good, though. How are you, Robbo? A few more hills than Lonnie. Yeah, yeah, a little bit uh, undulating, you would say. Yeah, good, a little bit lumpy. It's good, though. Good. What's, good the temper What's the temperature? Oh, below 10. Yeah, <laughs> below zero. <laughs> Not quite that cold. Right, I better harden up then. <laughs> I'm champion. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, well done. Hold on. Hold on. Great stuff. Hold on. Hold on, buddy. Hold on. Park Run tourist Brendan, mate, give us your summation of Hobart Park Run. Uh, it's a beautiful course. It's um, really, really nice near the famous Risdon Brook Dam. Um, it's an out and back, so lots of high fives. Um, it's challenging, um, but but a beginner would still have a fair chance of going quite well on it. Um, but uh, one to add to your bucket list, uh, whoever's in Hobart. Now with event director and timekeeper today, Lindsay. How are we looking, Lindsay? 135 people already. Wow, and many to come yet? Uh, maybe another 20. Wow. Is that uh, about on track with what you thought might happen? Yeah, we were picking 150 actually. So Very good. Happy with that. Very good. And any uh, any thought about leveling some of these hills out there? I hear a few people complaining about them. <laughs> hills make us stronger. There you go. You heard it, you heard it first from Hobart Parkrun. Right. Event director of Lonnie Parkrun. And mate, what does it mean to have another parkrun in Tasmania finally? Fantastic. We've been waiting a while, obviously, to get Hobart up and running. But yeah, it's nice to have a, another event. Um, and great for people coming to visit uh, Tassie, obviously, do Hobart and Launceston as well if they can. And made a little bit a little bit hillier course than Lonnie? Yeah, absolutely. I was, there was one that we're on the way out, sort of get a little bit of momentum up going down the hill. I thought that's going to be nasty going back up, and, and it was, but no, it's all good. All right. um, yeah, you don't want to flat out and back. It's nice to have a hilly out and back. Good, mate. Well, great to have you down here, and uh, safe travels back to Lonnie. We'll see you on the mainland sometime. Cheers, Robbo. Come back to Tassie anytime, mate. Co-event director of this, the launch of Hobart Park Run. How'd it go, Anna? Oh, it was great. It was so exciting to see everyone out there enjoying themselves and having a great morning. Excellent. You'll be back next week? Of course. Very excited. Very yeah. good. And you're looking forward to running it yourself? Um, yeah, a few hills is always good. Good for training. That'll be good to get out there. Here we have the inner workings of Hobart That's Park Run. So Just putting right? our yeah. uh, launch results in for the first time. Uh, double one. Key three eight. Three. No yeah, three eight. Two eight. We should two. have these results up and ready for no, you very shortly, folks. So that's him. Here we have it. Finally, we've <laughs> got the results all processed. We're about to make that very special move, Lindsay. It's in your hands. Uh, <gasps> there it is, folks. Yay! Hobart Park Run results coming to you very shortly. Well done, ladies. You up for doing that again next week and every other week of your life? Yeah. <laughs> Same time next week. Awesome. Yeah. Well done. That's how it's done, folks. See you next week.